yes now start with this uh, data integration problem okay now uh, why do we need a integration of a data so uh, see data integration means some merging of a data from multiple data stores so careful integration can help reduce and avoid the redundancies and inconsistencies in a data okay and that's the reason we say that uh, we need uh, this uh, data integration thing okay so let me explain you uh, all this data integration part very carefully so let's go back to our excel okay so here what i said now just now that the data integration is a pre processing method that involves merging of a data you can say uh, let me write it data integration okay what is it a pre processing method right which uh, which involves merging of data from different sources right and in order to form a data store right or we can say a data warehouse now what can be this different sources can anybody tell me see this different sources can be flat files or it can be say uh, data cubes or it can be some relational database we have like this we have multiple data sources aur jiska data hame integrate karna hai right now there are few issues in this data integration techniques so let's see what are these issues in data integration what are these issues the first issue is schema integration and object matching so i will tell you for let me write it schema integration and object matching correct now what what do you mean by schema integration and object matching chalo theek hai mere paas ek companies hai say a b and c as i already said the i have this three companies with me and uh, what i'm trying to do i am going to create one data store for these three companies correct i will be creating a data store for this three companies right to so three company mein data kahan se aane wala hai a se b se and c se data aane wala hai ab a ne kya kiya a has stored a data which i already told you a has stored a data as employee id fine a has stored a data as employee id b has stored the data as just a id and the c has a stored a data as emp number so everybody has stored a data in different way and jab when i am mapping this data into single data warehouse a single data warehouse i want to create from all these data from a b c i need to do the schema integration and object matching over here understood all of you what do you mean by schema integration and object matching ki ye uh, ye employee id emp id id and employee number sab same hai but how do my machine will come to know ki ye sara same hai mujhe to wo samajh mein aa raha hai as a human ki this all things are same but how do my machine will understand ki ye teen cheeze same hai so this is how i am going to do this schema integration or object mapping okay now the second issue which i get in the data integration is redundancy now what do you mean by this redundancy redundancy is my unwanted attributes my data has become such a huge uh, ki mujhe handle nahi ho raha hai wo data correct to isliye there are few attributes which are unwanted which i want to remove so see i have a data like this employee number date of birth date of birth and then i have uh, i have salary and then i have age correct uh, or it is data is of almost 1 uh, lakh people correct so imagine such a huge data and my data warehouse don't want to handle a huge data correct so what i can do i can remove this age wala column i can remove this age wala column very easily because age and date of birth these are redundant data correct age and date of birth are redundant data 
so i i at any moment of time i will be able to calculate the age from the date of birth right and that's the reason i say this is a redundant data and which is to be removed correct so this is also one of the issue in a data integration correct this is also one of the issue in data integration correct now let us move and see the third issue for a data integration and it is a detection and resolution of data value conflicts there can be few conflicts jaise ki i will tell you one example say uh, one of the company uh, say a company a has represented its price in a dollar correct and company b has represented its price of atom in rupees right now this dollar cannot be directly mapped to the rupees means maine dollar ko रिप्लेस विथ आर एस ऐसे तो नहीं कर सकती हूँ ना क्योंकि डॉलर का वैल्यू अलग है रुपीज का वैल्यू अलग है सो आई नीड आई नीड टू हैव सम कन्वर्जन पैरामीटर ओवर देर सो फर्स्ट टास्क इज माई मशीन शुड बी एबल टू डिटेक्ट इट एंड देन रिजोल्व दिस कॉन्फ्लिक्ट ऑल्सो सो दीज आर डिफरेंट टास्क विच आर इन्वॉल्व सो दिस इज दीज आर ऑल कॉल्ड एज डेटा इंटीग्रेशन इश्यूज i hope you all have understood data integration issues and what is data integration so let me repeat it again what the data integration term is a term uh, which is uh, used for merging of a data from different sources so which can be used for the data analysis purpose or and even it can be stored in the data warehouses so that is my data integration and the issues which are involved in the data integration are schema integration and object matching so jo maine aapko bataya ki a b c alag alag companies hai jisme ek ek emp id karke employee ka id represent karta hai ek id karke represent karta hai and ek emp number karke represent karta hai so when i am trying to merge this all data for a single data warehouse my machine should understand that these three fields are same and it should merge it properly even i can have a redundant data which is need to be removed and then i am supposed to detect and resolve the data conflict so this is what uh, the challenges which had uh, which i have in a data integration part so this is what i have said uh, i have explained you and this redundant data occur when integration of multiple databases are there uh, like uh, the same attribute of the objects may have the different names jo maine bataya and even there can be the derived attributes like uh, age is a derived attribute from the date of birth so redundant attributes may be able to detect by the correlation analysis or covariance analysis right uh, and the careful integration of this data is very much required when we go for the data analysis process and that's the reason it it is always involved in a data integration part 